This vast frozen wilderness is Kangalusuak Glacier on East Greenland. What may look like a solid block of ice is in fact one of the fastest moving glaciers on the planet. Oceanographer Fiamma Starneo from Woods Hole Institution is here to find out exactly why Kangalusuak has started to accelerate. Well, what we think is happening is there have been uh, changes in ocean circulation. There's more warm water carried by the Gulf Stream in the high latitude. And we think more warm water is reaching the edge of these glaciers. And the timing of this coincided roughly with the timing of when the glaciers started to accelerate. So we think there's a correlation there, but what we're missing are the measurements from the fjords, which is what we're trying to get at. As many other glaciers in Greenland, Kangalusuak is not only flowing faster, but is also retreating, releasing massive amounts of ice into the ocean. In 2009, collaborating with environmental organization Greenpeace, Straneo placed instruments measuring water temperature and other parameters deep in Kangalusuak Fjord. Recovering these devices exactly one year later provides her with a unique data set showing what's happening to the fjord's waters over an annual cycle. What I'm showing here is a comparison of uh, the temperature in the fjord. This is the mouth of the fjord, this is the glacier end, and we see warm waters at depth uh, below 200 meters entering the fjord, reaching all the way up to the glacier and driving melting. And from the moored instruments we've recovered from the fjord, we know that these waters are here year-round, that they're driving melting year-round. At present, melting of Greenland's ice accounts for around one quarter of global sea level rise. And this contribution could quickly increase as these glaciers accelerate their flow rate into the ocean. Continuity of Straneo's research, as that of other scientists working on the glaciers here, is secured through the support of environmental organization Greenpeace. What's happening here in Greenland is important for all of us because each iceberg which is carving into the ocean in Greenland will have a direct impact on the sea level. We are seeing far too slow progress in the political arena to avoid runaway climate change. And we are showing here the urgency of the issue. Scientific models indicate climate change will affect ocean currents flowing to the Arctic. As change comes quickly to Greenland, Research may also provide urgently needed answers to why its glaciers are melting faster than expected and what this will mean for global sea level rise.